Hello everyone. Welcome back to Graphic Hunters. In today's video, we're going to dive into creating a sleek and moderns monogram logo within a polygon. I'll show you step by step how to design this logo perfectly, from setting up your grid to the final touches. This design technique is great for giving your logo a bold, professional look with a geometric twist. So, let's start the video. First take a line segment tool, and draw a line. Give it stroke color. Now copy the line by hold alter, and make total 14 lines by hold control, and pressing D. Now select all lines, and make it vertical align center. Now I'm going to make hexagon grid by the lines, so first copy the lines by press Ctrl C and Ctrl F. Now go transform, and rotate it 120 degree. Now reverse the rotate line, for reverse, click right button of mouse, then click on transform, click on reflect, and click on copy. Again copy the select by press Ctrl C and Ctrl F. Now go transform, and rotate it 0 degree. As you can see my friends, I have made hexagon grid very easily following few step, so you can also make by following these step. Now select everything, reduce the stroke width for better understand the grid. Ok, that's good. Now select everything, and rotate the whole grid 90 degree like that. And make it group. Ok, that's good. Now press Ctrl R for showing roller, as you can see friends, there is roller in the two side. Now carefully place the roller on the grid because I will do the design perfectly. I have taken another roller by gap 4 lines. So do it for the bottom side. Ok, that's good. Now take polygon tool, and draw a hexagon like that. Now rotate it 90 degree and give a fill color. Now reduce the opacity. Now place the hexagon to the middle of the grid like that. Ok, that's good. Now select the hexagon, and copy it by press Ctrl C and Ctrl F. And make it one line bigger like that. Ok, that's good. Now take ellipse tool, and draw a circle in the grid line like that. Swap fill color to stroke color. Now select the hexagon and circle, and make it vertical align center. Ok, that's good. Actually, there is no work of this hexagon, but I take it for understanding the space where I'm going to design the logo letter. So select the hexagon, and reduce the opacity and lock it by press Ctrl 2. Now select everything. Take Shape Builder tool, must turn on fill color. And draw the logo letter S. This is a very easy design, I can do it within very short time, but time needed when you want perfection to your logo. Carefully fill up each and every gap otherwise your design will not be perfect. Ok, 
Okay, that's good, I have designed it. Now I need to move the design above from the grid. First of all, select the design, as you can see there are line attached to the logo, so I need first to ungroup the logo. Now select the logo by hold shift, and move it from the grid. Okay, that's good. Do not scale up and down your logo, keep the same which you get from the grid. And turn off the stroke color. And make it group. Now take a rectangle. And draw a rectangle between the two line like that. Now keep it aside. And make it longer like that. Also make it half like that. Okay, that's good. Now select the hexagon, and increase the opacity to 100%. Select the rectangle, and change the color to red like that. Now place the rectangle perfectly on the hexagon like that. For better understanding of perfection, go outline mode by press Ctrl Y. As you can see, this rectangle perfectly placed. Back to normal mode by press Ctrl Y. By hold alter, place the rectangle on the left side like before. Now select two rectangle, make it middle align center, and make it group. Now select everything and make it middle align center. OK, that's good. But I did a mistake, you should take rectangle which must be cross the circle. So I ungroup it first. And make it bigger like that. This is very easy task, anyone can do it. Okay, that's good. Now select everything, take shape builder tool. By hold alter, delete these part like that. Now go Pathfinder, and make it united. Now select the both design, and make it middle align center. Again select the design, and change the color to black. Ok, that's good. As you can see friends, this is how I design the logo with perfect space and gap. And there you have it, a clean and modern's monogram logo inside a polygon, designed perfectly from start to finish. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and that you're feeling inspired to create your own unique designs. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow designers, and of course, hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on future tutorials. Let me know in the comments what kind of logos or design techniques you'd like to see next. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.